Good afternoon, everybody. Thank you for joining us today. We're going to do an afternoon opening of boxes before tour. So we got Pebbles helping us with our opening of the boxes. Hey, Pebbles. I'm going to play with this. Oh, that's what we're going to do at the same time. We got Tina and Carrot on the wheel at the same time. You know, you're such a good boy. Mm -hmm. Sorry about that, guys. Hi, Camille. All right, and our first box we have, we're the kitchen, and it's the cat food is, and the packets of cat food alone, especially our special kitchen. Whoever sent that, thank you. What are you doing, Pebbles? She's like, I'm going to open the boxes. And there is also one more day left on the contest. Yeah, you can win the contest. Yeah, you can win the contest. Yeah, you can win the contest. Yeah, that contest. Yes, you can win 5000 and the cats can get 5000 as well. So. Okay, this is from Melanie Tipton. It says, enjoy sweet kitties. Thank you, Mrs. Melanie Tipton. It's some of the BFF cat food. It's a case of it, and this is also the little packets that the cats love. They like the packets because it has more liquid in it. They love the gravy. So thank you, Melanie Tipton. Put these here. I guess I'm going to get the box of pebbles on my <laughs> She's like, this is my box. Oh, no. I think I scared her. Oh, it's cash. What are you doing, Greta? Greta said she's waiting. Alright, in this box we have some Clorox cleanup. That's one, two, three, three of those. And also we have some printer ink. And we use the printer ink to send thank you cards and everything. And we use this to clean the litter boxes and help clean the room. We do as much disinfectant as we possibly can here. Like you can't just leave stuff around. No. I guess Jelly Bee must be asleep because he's not in here. I didn't even hear it. Yeah, it's like, yeah. Go carrot. Good boy, carrot. Look at Tina. Look at the package. He wants to see who sent him all these gifts. Like those. <laughs> Cats like playing with these too. Oh yeah. What do we have in here? This is the three boxes in here. Oh, that's a one to see what it is. It might be cute. Probably have to leave one of these boxes in the room for the cats. Yeah, they want to play with them. That's just like, what is it? So thank you if you're out there watching right now. Thank you. I'm going to leave this, this one. The cat man. It's, they're good cat traps. All you got to do is put a box down and you got a cat in it. Especially around here. Chester cleaned that box. I'm going to put this one next. Carrot's still on that wheel. We gotta get them healthy food. Oh yeah, the cats, they love the healthy food. And this doesn't have a packet slip with it, so thank you for ever sent this. Can I put a cat Meow. Peanut's just into everything right now. The box is out of the box. 
That's why you know it's good. You got a double box set. Watch that. Okay, we have some syringes. Okay, we have some syringes. There's a box of the 1cc syringes. We use these for medicine, like lecture loads, and medicine that we don't have to get a lot, give a lot of. And we do go through a lot of them, especially in those houses. Carrot, yes, carrot loves boxes and anything he can get in. Hi, oh, carrot. And Peanut said he's gonna have a turn. He's like, what is it? Hi, Pebbles. Did you get tired of helping? She says she wants to play. We already have cat food in this box. There's two cases, and it is the. The Beyond. It's the Beyond cat food. It is called chicken. Chicken and sweet potato recipe, actually. So there's two of these. And we're glad to have all this cat food because when you work with all these cats, you have to have a variety. If you don't have a variety, they'll get really picky if they have to eat just one time. Thank you for ever sent that. In here. <laughs> We're trapped. Look, but at least the cats look like they're gonna have fun with all these boxes. We try to get the syringes, or maybe he throws my cat food through there. That's just like you might want that. There's another box, and in this box we have two of these. That's the soap, right? Yes, the um, seventh generation. like claiming the cat food. This is all mine. <laughs> and the bigger box. It is a variety box. There's a couple cases of these in there. I'm going to show you what they are. They are the Clorox bleach pack. And each of these boxes has four of them in it. And we use these for the laundry, and we also use them to clean the rooms with. It's a really good way to disinfect without having to deal with the liquids. And we got some cat food, some word for cat food. And then we have some BHS cat food. This is called tuna and baby cakes. Tuna and beef baby cakes. So we're gonna see who is outside. So thank you for joining us for our 3 p.m. tour, as well as opening the boxes. We are in room two, if you guys hadn't noticed that. I know we didn't state that earlier, but it is in room two. We're gonna start out with Miss Ella, cause she runs stuff around here. And she was sitting pretty when I opened that door. So here's Miss Ella Bella, our princess of room two. She came to us from a local shelter. One of our workers here actually found her at the shelter. Um, she was looking for a cat for a friend of hers when she seen Ella. Ella was there and she was blind. She was on the list to be euthanized. Um, she was actually gonna get euthanized that day if I'm not mistaken. And Chris contacted Elena and all is all because Ella's here. She's been here since. Oh, Ella.
and she runs stuff in this room. All right, keeping in with that, we're gonna move on to the bully of the room. It's my Jelly Bean. Jelly Bean is in here with his two brothers, Peanut and Skittle. They've been here since they were kittens. We call them the Mew Brothers. Hi, oh, Jelly Bean. He's like, no, I want to sleep, man. You just want to go to sleep? Is that all it is, Jelly Bean? And speaking of his brother, here's Mr. Skittles. Skittles. He was just getting some love. Skittles. Hey. Skittles. Hey. Hey, you handsome. You hear some birds. You hear them, Skittles? Hi, Jelly Bean. Jelly Bean's usually our wheel runner. He likes to get on your neck as well. He likes to sit on your shoulders. All right, moving on. We're gonna see Miss Poppy. Oh, Miss Poppy's getting cute. Here's being cute. Oh, I just wanna point this out. He didn't want me to show you guys. Wanted nothing to do with me, but the minute I walked away, he had to follow me. We got Papa Felix using me as a, I don't know what I was there. I was a scratcher. Huh. What is it? Hey, Felix. And Poppy. Poppy has a brother here in room one. They came to us from New York. What, Poppy? What, Felix? Hey. Poppy. Hey, Felix. Meow. Felix is one of our talkers here. We've got a few talkers in this house. Jelly Bean, you come to join me? Coming to join me? Everybody come to join me? Wanted nothing to do with me a minute ago, Skittle. Jelly Bean playing with his brother's tail. Poppy said she's done with us. Oh, pretty girl. And I'm pretty sure I've seen Camille come out. I sure did. I know she was helping us with our boxes earlier. Let's get a better look here at Camille. Hi, pretty girl. Hi, pretty. And again, the cat that wanted nothing to do with me just a few seconds ago has followed me yet again. Come on, Skiddles. I think he just might have missed me. And then he was angry. Hi, hey, Poppy. Are you coming to see us again? All right. So that's all the cats outside. So I'm going to go inside and take a look around. What are you doing, Felix? Well, yeah. We do have some guests. We have some visitors right now, so. Come on, Felix. Gotta let the boys in. Come on. I'm gonna start over here on this side. And sleeping, we have Burrio. I'm not going to mess with him. I'm going to let him get him rest. And right next to him is Peanut. This is Jelly Bean and Skittles' brother. They're the last of the new brothers. See if he'll let me pet him now. He's like, no. And here we have Karen. He was, he was in a box, and then he heard me come in here. Right now, I told them we had visitors visiting oh. the cats right now. Yeah. And here we got Pebbles. 
She was helping us do boxes a few minutes ago. Mm -hmm. you, you're gonna go under me, Pebbles? Our sweet cats in here. And here we have Miss Greta. Can you have another set of eyes? Can you see that? They don't have any eyes. Over there. See? Over there. There's one set, but they don't work. And she's got one. Oh, it's seven feet. No. The only ones, real fast, guys, the only ones in this room that can see is Skittle, who's the one that's laying outside. Okay. Ella can see out of her one eye. Okay. And there's a cat on the climber all the way back there. Her name is Camille. She can see as well. She's the only one that can see. Yeah, they, um, we usually, carrots on a wheel. So, uh, earlier there was both of them on the wheel. They just like it? Just mm -hmm. for exercise or for fun? Yeah. We have uh, usually, the, um, we have a cat out there that's usually on here. We have a bunch of cats in here that'll play on this wheel. I'm very sorry, guys. We just have a visitor. Um. But yeah, no, they're really active, like her, Honey, which I'm going to show Honey right now. This is Honey. Honey is one of our softest furred cat here. Um, it's really silky. Honey lost her eyesight due to a car accident. So even though that they're in there, they don't work. Hi, oh, pretty girl. And there's Poppy. All right, guys. I think that's all the cats in here. We're going to move on. We're going to go into room number three. Here's Bunny, but we're going to visit with her in a minute. Looks like she's trying to eat, so I don't want to bother her. Here's room number three. We're going to start off here with Miss Jenny. Let me just move something here. Hi, Jenny. I don't really like messing with her so much. She's a little old girl and she just likes to be left alone. She loves to be petted on. I just like to give her her space. And, and coming to join us, we have oh, perfect face. Oh, she had to put her face down. Is Ms. Molly. Hi, Molly. Molly is such a lover. She's very shy, though. She doesn't like you to look at her face. Pretty girl. And here also joining us is Marge, waiting very patiently. Marge is another cat that likes to get up in your lap and get loved. Hello, oh, Marge. This is what they do. These cats in this room are more or less our lap cats. They just love you. They want the attention. They want to be in your lap. Oh, Marge. Okay, Molly. I'm going to have to put you out of my lap because we got to see all the other kitties too. She's like, no. <laughs> okay, Molly. Put you over here, baby girl. All right. Coming over here. This angel looks like she's coming to join us. We're going to come over here, Miss Angel. Come here, Angel. Come here. Hi, Angel. Hi. You going to let me get your face, pretty girl? Huh? And Hermes came to join us. Now, Hermes is one of two males in here. All the rest are females. Just in case for those that didn't know, he is just one of two males. Hi, Angel. When I tell you about Marge, if you give her a chance, she waited patiently, and she does. She says now it's her turn. Oh, Hermes! Hermes usually likes to do tour with us, to follow you around and wait for you. Marge. Uh, for those of you guys that don't know, Marge came to us from a breeder who, when she was born, I guess she didn't meet the breeding requirements, the standards, and kind of just tossed her to the side. Marge is such a sweet girl. We don't like breeders for that reason. Not all breeders are like that, but in her case, it's all they cared about. Angel. 
Angel. You're still sitting there just waiting. Oh, such a pretty girl. Hermes is all on her way home. Huh? He's just getting you with that tail. Alrighty, I think this is all the cats that are inside for this room. So we're gonna go outside and see the cats that are out there. See who we have. There's our Molly girl. She came outside. Let me get a good picture of her. Good shot of her actually. Not a picture. Moving on, I see Tori down here. So we're gonna come sit with Miss Tori. See if I can get to Miss Tori. Hi, pretty girl. Hi, Hi, mamas. Hermes. Hermes is all in the way. Come on, Tori. Hermes, you cannot just be the center of attention. You cannot be the center of attention all the time. Hi, Tori. All right, Hermes. Because all you want is that attention. All he wants is love. Love. All right. Moving over here is Miss Annie. Annie is our curly tail cat. Usually when she gets up and, you know, moving her curl, her tail curls up to her body. When she's laying, it's the only time it's really not so curled. Hi, Annie. Annie says she's just trying to get her afternoon nap in. Yes, Hermes. Hermes is still with us on this tour. He wants to let you guys know he's still here. Mommy. Alright. Moving on over here. We got Miss Penny. Her name is Penny. Oh. Most of you guys that do know this, for those of you that don't, Penny is our only blind and deaf cat. So I like to let Penny know that I'm here before I pet her. You're not gonna see let's see your face, Penny? She's like, no. Penny's such a sweet cat. There's them beautiful green eyes. Yes. Some beautiful eyeballs. And underneath her, if he'll come out, is Mr. Boone. Hey, Boone. Is that Boone? This is Boone. He likes to be loved on and he likes cuddles. Boone. Boone wants nothing to do with me. He wants to play with the visitors. Alright, so moving on, we're going to see is Miss Olivia. Olivia has a sister, Natasha. She's in room one. Olivia is another one of our talkers. I'm surprised she's not talking to me this morning or this afternoon. Olivia. Hey. Hey, baby. Pretty girl. Sorry, it's trying to see the kitties through these climbers. Hi, Lydia. Alrighty, let's see who else we have. Oh! Almost tripped over the kitties. I think the only one we have left is, is Lily. Where is our Lily girl? Lily came inside. There she is. Real fast, I can show you Boone. Because he had ran off. He was too busy with the visitors. 
What is handsome Phil? I like to call Boone our mountain kitty. He came from the mountains. He's a big old boy. He looks like a mountain kitty, huh? All right. And last but not least, we're gonna see Miss Lily. Miss Lily is our talker. And there you go. Well, tell me all about it, Lily. We call her Silly Lily. Why well, do? Sometimes she likes to act silly. Huh. Lily likes to always try to climb on me. She's never did it. But she tries. Will you give me hugs, Lily? Yes. All right, Lily. Let's get a good view of your face. We're going to tell them, see and come back and see us tonight for tonight's tour. Tell them. Come back and see you tonight for tour. All right, guys. This is it for room three. So we're going to move on to room four. I feel like we're just following the visitors. So we're going to come in here anyways. They're all here ready to be played with. All right. All right, guys, sorry about that. We're going to start right here with Smudge. He's usually outside. Smudge is the sniffer. He likes to smell me. She came to join us, so we're going to visit with Miss Emily. Emily's one of our player kitties in here. She loves to play. Hi, Emily. You like to play? All right, then moving on, we got Jewel. Jewel's the type of cat that she loves the attention, she loves to get loved on. She doesn't care too much for the other cat, so she kind of sticks to herself. And just because she doesn't run up to you doesn't mean that she doesn't like it. She just doesn't want to deal with the other cats. <laughs> Huh, pretty girl. All right. I'm going to just move your banana a little bit, Jules, so I can get through. And here we have Lisa. Hey, Lisa. This is Nikki. This is Rudy. No, it's not. This is Richie. Sorry. Richie. Sorry. Rudy's a little bit. All right. Sorry, guys. The inner connection is kind of today. This is Lisa. She's a very playful kitty in this room. Let's see if she's only doing the front leg. Yes. She already only. Yeah, she does scare like her all of it, but like I always see her with the two paws. She's working out. I just wonder why I was here. What? That's the one of me. She can say. Oh, that's the one we were discussing? Yeah. Okay. I was like, <laughs> And here's Casper walking in on us. She's still trying to climb your legs, too. Hi, sweetheart. Oh, Jewel. That's not nice. And here we got Miss Pixie. Pixie's another one of the cats in here that love to be on the wheel. There's like six of them in this room. This room and room two, it's like a lot of them. Yeah. Come on, Pixie. Okay. <laughs> and sitting right here waiting patiently is Rudy. Hey, handsome. Aw, Jewel, you want some love? <laughs> She's working on her, her upper body. Yeah. What do you upper think, arm. Baby? Good. Yeah? 
And in this box, I thought I seen a cat swatting. It's Candy. Hey. Candy's our cat that acts like a baby. She likes to be held like a baby. And if you don't give her enough tension, she throws a temper tantrum like a baby. Don't you, Candy? Oh, stop, Candy. No. And here we have Casper. I know I've seen Casper, but he's here again. Oh, here we got Richie. Well, real fast before I walked over with Sandy, he's hiding. A lot of excitement going on here. Here we got Richie. Hey. And she's like, no, I want you. And he was other oh, smudge again. He went in from there to there. I believe I've seen all the cats inside. The only cat outside that I see is Mickey. Casper made it outside. Let me show Casper's face, because I didn't get to see that earlier. Casper! Hey, handsome. Hey. 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 It's me. I haven't seen you in a few days. Huh, buddies? Hi, Casper. And here's Sandy coming to join us. It was a little loud in there. Huh. And Emily. Our play kitty. Hey, Emily. Hey, Casper. Mickey. Mickey is our hugger of the room. He always gives hugs. Oh, handsome boy. Alright guys, this is all in room four, so we're going to say bye. Bye Sandy. We're going to go to room one. Lisa, such a playful kitty. What are you looking for, Lisa? What about you, Emily? All right, guys, we're gonna move on to room one now. Say bye, Pixie. Bye, Rudy. Bye, Jewel. Stop and visit with Snickers. Snickers, one of our lobby cats here. Oh, we got them both right here. We got two lobby cats in this house. We got Snicker, our boy, and Bunny, which is our female. Let me show Snickers first since he was here. Oh, handsome. And this is where we got Bunny. Bunny loves hanging out by the front door. She likes to know who's coming and going. Oh, pretty girl. Bun -bun. All right, guys, let's go and move on to room number one. <coughs> All right, we're going to start off with Natasha. Remember, I told you this is Olivia's sister. Olivia's in room three. This is Natasha. Hi, pretty. Natasha's one of those cats that she likes it. You just got to give her a minute. If you come in here and sit down, though, Natasha will probably more likely come and come to you. She likes the quiet. 
That's really what her problem is. See if I can get your pretty face, Natasha. There we go. We have Jamie. Sorry, it took me a second, guys. I was just trying to make sure it was Jamie, not Serena. Jamie and Serena look a lot alike. The difference one's got a white streak, and Jamie is our vampire kitty, so I had to look for the fang. Jamie's gonna get in my cat in my lap. However, I already have a cat there. And I got Yoshi. Come on, Jamie. Come on. And then the other lap. Yeah. Like I said, I did have Yoshi in my lap. Yoshi has walked off to get food. Yoshi! Now me eat it. This is what Jamie likes to do. Jamie is a lap cat. Alright guys, sorry about that. He's also the brother of Poppy, who I was talking about earlier. Alright Jamie, you know you're going to have to get out of my lap because I got to show the other kitty cats. Jamie, you have to move Jamie and get up quick because if you give him any chance to get back in your lap, he'll be in it. Here's Yoshi. Yoshi's another one that likes to get in your lap. Usually when I'm sitting in here, it's Yoshi and uh, Jamie that are in my lap. All right, moving on from that, we have Miss Georgia. You know, want to show me your face, Georgia? Oh, there it is. Georgia looks like she's trying to get her nap in. Yes, Jamie, I told you, I haven't moved up off the floor. He's coming back. This is what he does. Anything to be in your lap. And also right here we have old man Keller. I'm not going to bother Keller because he's sleeping. I really don't like to bother the cats when they're sleeping, especially when they're older, like him. I'm going to show you his prettiness. And then I got to get Jamie out of my lap again. Thank you, Jamie. And we're going to move on to the cats outside. That's where they're all at. Real fast because she looks like she's gonna run. We have Miss Serena. Hey, it's okay, Serena. Hey, it's okay, baby. Again, Serena doesn't mind being pet. Again, it's she likes the more quiet. You know, don't come in here being really loud with her. She won't like that. This is Stevie that's in my way. He's he's in here. He let me know he's here. And I just want to point out, this is Jamie trying to get on my lap again. I don't know what he's doing. But we got Serena over here. Jamie! I'm very sorry, guys. I got... Bye, <laughs> dog. I'm very sorry about it. All right, here's Stevie. This is Willow's brother. Willow's one of our talkers. Oh, yes, pretty girl. I do like to spend a little bit more time petting on Serena. My reason behind this is because Serena's one of the cats that she doesn't like it, or that's what you're told. Um, however, you can see she likes it. She's still just very skim, you know, scared, timid. So I do like to pet her a little bit longer than the other cats. Kind of working on building up the trust with her, getting her to not be so skittish every time somebody comes in here. All right. I'm really alone, Serena. Thank you. And then we're going to go back with Stevie because he was waiting somewhat patiently. Stevie's our hairdresser in this room. He likes to get on your shoulders and fix your hair. Also, while I was sitting out here waiting, this 
This big old boy came up to me and laid down and he's waiting patiently. This is Griffin. Griffin is our France cat. He came all the way from France. He is also our biggest here, weighing in at 22 and a half pounds. I think that's what it was this week, was 22.5. Griffin is the biggest cat, but he is like one of the most lovingest cats, too. He's always flicking his tail, too, just like a dog. Huh, just flicking that tail. All right, moving on. We have Willow. You going to talk to me, Willow? No? You not going to talk to me today? She's like, no, it's too hot for that. Willow is one of our biggest talkers and our loudest. Oh, Willow. And if you don't believe me, come in here at 7.30 in the morning. She's hollering for her food. It's loud. You'll hear it as soon as you hit that door. Huh. She says you ready for breakfast times in the mornings. down here sleeping. I'm not going to mess with him because it's hot and he's tired. It's liggerish. He's right here. Oh, he heard me. Oh, yes, he is a boy. Alright, and last but not least in this room is Wi-Fi. He said he has some Wi-Fi. Gotta let him know that he likes me. Yes, Wi-Fi is me. It's me. Handsome boy. All right, guys, and that's all the cats here. Also, real fast, I know she was talking about the don't forget our contest is ending. If you enter it, you can win 5000 for yourself. The cats can win 5000 Also, don't forget to do our daily clicks. It's not a click anymore. It's more like the questions. So daily questions, do our daily questions. All the money adds up, and it helps the cats tremendously. What are you doing, Wi-Fi? Also, don't forget to come back this afternoon, this evening, for Cats, Chats, and Boxes with Chris, as well as Tour Tonight. Thank you.